What's up guys, Mike from Illuminator Index here. I've wanted to open this all day. I've seen these, I've seen pictures of these on the internet. I've never actually held one in person and I've never actually seen a real version of this color. So without further ado, let's open the Kaizen 6 in Bleeding Heart. Okay, here we go. You're gonna see it with me. First impressions. Let's get this thing open. Dude, that color is insane. I'm just gonna tear this open. It's incredibly light, super light. Whoa, that's light. This is easily the lightest guitar that I have. Whoa. Look at that neck. Dude, super cool. It's, it's pink, but with the light, it looks like almost like a ruby red, um, like a Kramer that I used to have. This thing is super cool. Dude, that neck is so thin. It's such a strange shape too. Wow, that's a crazy low action. The neck is so nice, it's really light. Good balance, it's surprisingly incredibly balanced. The multi-scale isn't actually that noticeable. Um, the infinity radius is cool because you can feel it is a little thicker toward the bottom and you can see the whole fretboard all the time, almost like it's, it's bent toward you, if that makes sense. It's incredibly well balanced. Um, this is actually the first time I've ever seen these, uh, these uh, tuning machines. I'm actually not entirely sure how to use them, so I'll have to mess with them but everything on this thing is super nice. It's crazy. The finish part of it and then the actual gun oil uh, finish on the neck. So this is it. This is uh, at least the first that I've seen on the internet aside from uh, uh, Tosin, um, his, his seven string that he put on his uh, personal Instagram. Anyways, guys, we're gonna do a full review of this um, next week for my gear rundown. Uh, so follow and uh, subscribe and I'll have some more info and, uh, and thoughts on this uh, awesome guitar. Cool, see you guys then.